got some drippage going on. Looks like coolant. So we got it in the garage. We're going to jack her up and see what's going on. It's not like really green. It's weird. Let's get some light under here. So the last time we seen the car. Baby, that, that's, that's not lotion. It's not lotion. That's Vaseline, baby. So it seems right there where this bracket bolts up to the radiator is cracked. Right at that bracket where it meets the radio. Got a little small leak. We also have another radiator. Oh yeah, that thing's leaking pretty good. I just wiped it off and it's already starting to drip again. Yeah, boy. So something we gotta get fixed. But what I don't know is, is that part of the radiator or is that like part of the transmission gully, galley, whatever you wanna call it? Because the fluid seems not to be really green and um it's only leaking a little bit that might be like the transmission baby. i don't know so boom welcome back to the channel everybody man it's been a week since the dragon and it's just you know life goes on man and we continue to boom it out you know what i'm saying so i got a special one for y'all today man so sit back Stay tuned and let's go. Upon further investigation, the back drive has been sitting here a couple hours now. So where it was leaking was definitely from the transmission line area. But look here, we got some new content coming. The homie Parker has somehow gotten this thing to stop running. So. I am tasked with getting her back running. We did it once before, we're gonna do it again. It's fair on shop, stay tuned. Right here, Poppy on the pull up. What up with you, bro? What you got for me, man? Look out for the cook on. That what's up? Because I ordered the lip. Wow, I got you. Buddy. What? What? I got tires. So if I'm getting tires, right? That, that must mean something, y'all. That got to mean. Look at this fucking guy. Look at this fucking guy. Got you, my G. Would you look at this fucking guy? <laughs> oh, that's fucking Liddy. Wow! Shout out to the homie, man. <laughs> oh, that's fucking dope. That's dope as shit, bro. I appreciate you, man. And finally, in the garage, man. four wheels with four tires. Look at the size of these tires. Y'all ain't, ain't seen the size. 195, 40, 16. I'm shit's about to look so good on the EF, man. Really gonna look good on the EF. Put the, put the garage back in work mode. You know, we gotta pull out the toolbox, pull out the cherry picker, get all that stuff from back in there because the wagon kind of long. All these old lines and shit, the wrong lines that I've ordered, we gotta send those back. You know, we got some work to do, man, in the Feron shop.
in there. This is how the car was brought to me. So we got it on jack stands. We got the wheel off and first line of business, put this thing in time. Let me get to that and put it in time and I'll be back. Well, when I got it, as you can see, it didn't have the cover on. So we put the cover on there. You know, we got the pulley back on it. The cam is up, you know, in the up position. You know, this line is in the way, but I can assure you it is in the up position. Both the timing marks are here and here. That's in the right position. But when you look over here, the timing mark is there. You see it right there in the middle of the screen and then to the left is the three ignition timing marks. But I wanna say she's out of time. And that much out of time, definitely not gonna fire. So let's put this thing in time and see what we get. And we're back. We put it in time. Everything is in time. That little guy down there. That little guy down there is in time. Look down here, the balancing shaft. It's supposed to line up with that. That little groove. I don't know if you know what I'm talking about. The balance of that dot is supposed to line up with that groove, which you can see it is really, really close to that groove. It's on, damn it. That's, that's, that's on, right there. That's on. She's in time. And we tried to fire. She didn't do shit. So what I did, we went and grabbed our handy dandy laptop, hooked up our ostrich and our data logger. Tried to start it, no start. What I did have was an extra dizzy. So, real quick, we swapped out the dizzy. And let's see what we got. Can't just go right at it. You gotta take the goddamn wrench off there. You know, gotta take the wrench off. I don't know why that check engine light is on, but we're gonna find out. Come on, baby. All right, let's try this shit again. I don't know what the fuck that's about. Right, you hear that putt? Yeah, 
Something ain't right. Damn, I smoked up the whole garage too. Gonna do some adjusting man to see what the fuck going on but we run it we lit that's some weird shit going on it's doing that she's rich as fuck i mean rich as fuck at 10. so We running though. We are fucking running. Late night shenanigans, yo. We're gonna find out what the fuck is going on here though. I don't know. I don't understand what the fuck is going on there. Well, I don't like it though. I don't like that shit. Not one fucking bit. Look at that. like crazy and I dropped the fucking radiator tap and don't know exactly where the fuck front lip came in yes sir the homie dropped off some spark plugs so in that previous clip y'all seen that I it was nighttime I dropped the freaking radiator cap and we found it of course we had to oh. This is it right here. We had to wait until daylight. But the car is running. It's running kind of shitty. I don't know why. But I'm going to go ahead and end the video right here, man. If y'all like what y'all seeing, man, please make sure y'all like, share, and subscribe to the channel. And until next time, turn one. Peace. Also, in the next episode, hopefully we'll have this car running good. Homie Dylan is calling me right now.